What's up guys? It's July 14th, 2021 and we are going back in time to December 1st, 2020 to a little island called Koh Lipe in Thailand. <laughs> Thailand's most southern island. It borders Malaysia and it's part of the Terato Taruto Marine National Park. This island is so small that I don't think it took me any longer than 20 minutes to walk from anywhere to anywhere. It's known for some of the most beautiful scuba diving in all of Thailand, as well as crystal clear waters and a great getaway vacation spot for a few days. scuba dive. I did three dives for around 130 bucks. First place I went to was called 8 Mile. The visibility was 3 to 5 meters, the current was strong, and it was just not a good day to be out there and it really felt more of like just trying to survive than <laughs> enjoy and relax and chill. <laughs> Second dive, still at eight mile, we could see five to eight meters and it was a little better. expectations last dive end of the day we went to a spot called Stonehenge and oh my gosh this was the most beautiful dive I've ever had so many colors I felt like I was fresh out of a Disney movie like I was in a fairy tale this was so so gorgeous the current was still quite strong so it was difficult to stay put but wow this dive for sure made Colipe unforgettable sudden I see this big yellow wall and I'm thinking whoa what is that <laughs> and I get closer and closer and it's so many fish I had never seen so many fish of any species like all together they're just all hanging out together in their own little swarm of fish I am like trying to get you to feel a sunset through a picture right now this was so so incredible this was so cool
Kalipa, I think, is most known for the scuba diving and the snorkeling. But aside from that, there's also regular Thailand stuff, massages, fire dances, um, you can go on the walking street and eat all different sorts of foods and restaurants and things like this, reggae bars, yeah, lots of fun stuff. Kolipe did not seem to be much of a solo tourist attraction, much more of like a family vacation, couples island type of thing like this. However, if you hang around the hostels, of course you're going to find some solo travelers. I met some beautiful, shining souls. We had a great time. I think we hung out a day and a half, two days. I think I was only there for about three days. Had some amazing coconut ice cream, got some dinner, watched some fire shows, had a great, great, great night and it's a little blurry, but it was a good time. The day after scuba diving, I went on a snorkeling trip. It was like 20 US dollars, 600 Thai baht. It was so amazing. We went to like five different snorkel locations and it was so cool. I saw squids for the first time. It looked so strange, squidding around. And went to a few different islands just for some exploring and swimming and stuff like this. Saw wild boars for the first time. Got madly surrounded by monkeys. I hope you guys enjoyed diving into Kolipe with me. If you did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe, and hit the little bell next to subscribe so you'll get a little buzz in your phone. When I post a video, I would like you to get a little buzz in your phone. It says, hey, Noah posted a video. Yeah, I would like that. Yeah. Namaste.